Hello, I got a quick update video on the plotter since it was requested in the comments. A close up and explanation of the pen changing mechanism. It is difficult to film as it is very narrow and black against black, so both the camera angle and the lighting are a challenge, but I'm giving it my best shot anyway. First, the pen is cylindrical with a protruding disc in the center. This disc is the vertical alignment and needs to rest on the base plate in the pen magazine. The rubber stop that closes the pen is just a spring-loaded piece of plastic that moves up and down. The pen is held in place by a small hook that is spring-loaded. The shape of the hook is going to become vital soon. The pen holder has some protrusions and a similar spring-loaded hook, but that hook also comes with a little peg on top. When the plotter wants to pick up a pen, it moves the holder into the magazine. The smaller protrusion will align the holder and make sure it is moving in horizontally. The second protrusion will push down the rubber stopper to move it away from the pen. Now the hooks meet. Since the pen is in the magazine, the holder hook will slide the peg in between the pen and the magazine hook. This makes sure that the pen holder now grips the pen and the magazine grip is kept open by the peg. When the holder moves out again, it carries the pen along. When returning the pen, the alignment protrusion catches again, the stopper is pushed aside again like before. But when the hooks meet this time, the peg on the holder is outside of the hooks on the magazine. Thus, the magazine hook will grab the pen and when the holder retracts, it leaves the pen behind, firmly gripped by the magazine. Bottom line, some clever mechanical designs and levers make sure that the pen change is done just by moving the holder in and out of the magazine. I hope that clears things up. See you next time!